Hi, welcome to Kratos BI. My name is Chris Wagner, and today I'm going to be talking about blind spots. Join the Analytics Rebel Alliance. Fight for data literacy. Like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. Turn on alerts so you don't miss any future missions. All right, this isn't going to be our, our normal video. Uh, today, we're not going to be talking about data. We're not going to be talking about Power BI. We're not going to be talking about reporting or analytics. We're going to be talking about how you in the workforce and, and in your interactions with people may have blind spots in how you behave. I'm going to take this back to a story that, uh, that happened in my life uh, because I think that's something that we can all learn from and, and understand and realize how little things that we do can have significant impacts on people that we care about. Uh, about 10 years ago, I was working in a position uh, where uh, high stakes position, lots of pressure, lots of high demand deliverables that were just constantly going on. And I had a, 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 an engineering lead who was like the best. She, I could count on her for any and all of the biggest things that went on. She was my go-to individual. So anytime there was a high stakes issue that was happening, I would reach out to her I'd, and I explain what needed to be done and I could count on her to lock it in and get it done without a shadow of a doubt. Fortunately, what I didn't realize was uh, I have uh, a, a common issue that many people have, which is I, have, I suffer from acid reflux or GERD. And one of the things that people do uh, to alleviate the discomfort that comes along with this is they clear their throat in a uh, in a regular basis though. <clears throat> uh, I didn't like doing that because I, uh, I didn't like that sound. I was trying to be clever. So I would, <clears throat> I would do that under my breath. I would, <clears throat> <clears throat> well, uh, when things were very stressful, uh, these, this would happen more often. Uh, the net result was it sounded like I was growling all the time. And the re and what that meant was uh, my lead engineer, anytime I talked with her, more often than not, I was growling the entire time I was with her. And I had no idea that this was going on because I was starting, I was doing it subconsciously because it was happening so often. Well, one day there was a big issue that arose. We ran into a conference room. We were laying out all the things that needed to happen. And, uh, she kind of broke down in tears uh, about like not knowing what she had done. Why was I always so angry with her? Why was I growling at her? And at no point in time was I, was I ever even aware that this was happening. Honestly, she has always been uh, a, a, a close friend and, and remains to this day. I've always felt bad that, you know, that this was going on. And when I explained to her what was happening and that this was in no way a, a, a reflection of her performance or what was happening. And it was just simply a, a medical thing that was going on with me. Uh, we all had a big laugh and uh, it, it really opened my eyes to the need to be aware of blind spots that we may not be aware of how we're working, behaving or operating that may be negatively impacting other people. And that's really important uh, you know, if we're going to find our blind spots is to look for how people respond to us, to look at how we work and operate, show empathy of the people around them, but be sensitive and understanding that uh, if someone's going through something, you want to be open and try to engage them and help them with this because you never know when it's you. Right? Hopefully it's not right. Like, but you know, sometimes that that's the case. And if that's the case, and, you know, work to fix that, work to address that, right? Like I, I, I got my medicine balanced out. I don't grumble nearly as much as I, as I did, at least my wife says so. And, uh, but I do regularly check in on that. And that's something that if you're working on, if you found a blind spot and you're working on addressing it, make sure you continue to do ongoing checks to make sure that you're not continuing to do those things in the future. So uh, that's it. That's my story. This is all I have to talk about here. I hope that you find this helpful in how you work and interact with other people. Thank you guys very much. I know this is very different than my normal type of content, but uh, I, I realized that today I saw some of this stuff going on and I was actually, this allowed me to diffuse the situation and I wanted to share it with you. So thank you guys very much. Have a great day. Peace.